Are you secure? Yeah, for now. Lost your fucking mind? There's no time to explain. We must meet. Where are you? An abandoned apartment block on Pine Street. Second floor. Number 303. Knock four times. Hurry! I almost got trampled. I look okay to you? We're about to go live. Okay, come inside, quick. I fear that they had a coach. Now are you gonna tell me what the fuck you were thinking? I used a sedative. She tried to enable her tracker. I had no choice. I offered her some tea. You kidnap Hanako Arasaka and offer her a cup of fucking tea? Yes. She respectfully declined. Tell her the truth about Yorinobu. No embellishment. And state your terms clearly. Perhaps to you, she will listen. Hanako-sama, Kanojo ga rei no jinbutsu desu. Dou ka hanashi o kiite agete kudasai. I was there, that night at Konpeki Plaza. I saw Saburo Arasaka die. He wasn't poisoned. It's a lie your brother made up and spread. Yorinobu is the murderer. You must be mad to think I will listen to such nonsense. Why? My word means shit to you? Hanako-sama, I apologize on her behalf. Oh, shut up, Goro. We're supposed to be honest. Well, that's what I'm being. Fine. Maybe I am just a two-bit thief, but I'm the two-bit thief that stole that fucking relic off you. Slotted it in, took a bullet to the brain, died. You... died? Oh, yeah. Now I'm stuck with Johnny fucking Silverhand in there, and I'll do anything to get him out. 
So I got exactly nothing to lose. But you got lots. Hanako-sama, V is living proof of the terrible crime your brother committed. We can confirm every word she speaks if only you will help her with the relic. Hanako-sama. Did you hear that? Go and check. Got a bad feeling about this. Get the fuck out of here! Takamura! Can't leave him back Forget there. him, guy's toast! Unless you want to wind up like him. Surrender immediately! 
Kill! <laughs> the fuck you doing? You lost it? He's beyond any sort of help. Take me later. Need to find a way out now, fast! There are empty rooms to the right. It's our only chance.
Be careful. We must go different ways. Alone, we have a better chance. Really? Think so? Then go. Now. Oh, shit. Not good. Think they make these motels especially for royal fuck-ups like us? AC's busted, dirty needles under the mattress, shitters clogged. No, for real. Who fucking comes here to sleep? We're a couple miles outside Night City. Someone leaving town just keeps driving. Somebody going there sleeps in the damn city. What good's a motel in the middle of nowhere? I'll yep. tell just two fucking losers. And I thought we were screwed when Goro kidnapped Hanako. Mm-hmm. See, decide to cross a corp, this is what happens. You think you just stepped in shit. Actually, you fell head first into a cesspit. Anyone knocks, blast the fucking door. No warning. And if it's Goro? Who are you kidding? Been 24 hours since we split up. Complete radio silence. Rest in peace, bastard. Saw him yourself. Even without his implants, he was a good fighter. He'll pull through. Doesn't matter how good you are in Night City. On your own, you're fucked. Hear that? Car. At this hour, in this place? Fuck. Just one? Finger on the trick, V. Not a word. I have a message for V. Touch that door. I know you're in there. Finally. Ugh. That on the wall, is that blood? Yeah. Knock the last star off this dump. So, you were saying, got a message? Sitting right here. Oh, it'll start soon. What'll start? It's a doll. Or a proxy. <clears throat> I must make one thing clear. I still think you are mad, but... Monaco? That you? But I can fool myself no longer. I believe you. Any word from Goro? We split up when we went on the run. Takemura is in a secure location. 
That is all you need to know at this time. How'd you find me? Did you really think it would be enough to leave the city? Takamura mentioned he had placed a tracker on you. Yet even had he not, when Arasaka wishes to find someone, it finds them. Porcelain bitch. Okay. So now that you know and believe, what's next? Yorinobu planted a tanto in the corporation's very heart. I must act while the wound is fresh. And you will help me. You are living proof of his crime and treason. You're gonna help me first. Perhaps I did not speak clearly. We must act quickly. Well, I'm pretty tight on time too. Dying, in fact. My dead body would make for a pretty lame-ass witness. I understand. Wanna know everything you know about Mikoshi? Mikoshi? One of my father's flagship projects. A data fortress with servers situated on orbital stations all around Earth. Think of it as an archive of personality constructs, digitized psyches. Try a prison. A matter of perspective. In any case, that is not where you will find salvation. Not without extensive knowledge of the relic and the construct creation procedure. Track down your runaway. Helman was hiding under Kang Tao's wing. We chatted. I think sooner or later the engram will completely consume me. The process can't be stopped. A surprisingly deterministic conclusion for a man of science. At the very least, got my hands on the relic schematics. Got detailed information about its inner workings. Project tech documentation. All useful. Even more so given that Hellman is still alive. I will contact him and explain that one does not leave Arasaka by the back door. Managed to make contact with Ald Cunningham. The Cunningham? The very same who invented Soul Killer, using her own modified version now. That should be more than useful. That's about the extent of what we got. What now? Let us meet in person. At Embers, in the city center. It is discreet. Just remember one thing. From now on, we both must exercise extreme caution. Uh, well, that's my job done. You know what? What? I think I'd have rather had a wave of Sokka leads barging here. Got what we wanted. Don't tell me that proxy got to you. Fuck you. Come on, think about it. Yesterday, Hanukkah was living in a world that was completely safe for her. Now what she got on her hands now? A foreign city, a homicidal brother, and a fucking thief. It's why she sent a proxy. She's alone. And she is shitting herself more than we are. Uh-huh. Clink. What? Did you say clink? Mm-hmm. Sound of her attaching her leash. What's up? Got a few more words about the... the porcelain cunt? Fuck! <laughs> Shit. Get ready. Fuck. Johnny! You ain't dying yet. I got you.
Johnny. That smells the sea breeze. Get up. Pacific's beautiful this time of day. Almost flatlined by that attack. Almost. You're right. Hard to take my eyes off it. We in Pacifica? What's this building? Old hotel, the Pistis Sophia. We're her sole guests right now. Wanted to show you something. Come on. Why... Why bring me here, of all places? Give me a minute. You'll see. You took over. Couldn't just leave you there, could I? Nice to be behind the... Thanks for helping. What are imaginary friends for? Have you spent $100? Turn the favor first chance I get. Hold you to that. Your first thought was sex, wasn't it? Well, technically, we'd be jacking off, but nah, you're not my type. Climb through the window. Can manage that, I think. You wanted to know why I brought you here. There's a hidey hole where I'm standing. Open it. Empty it. These yours? They were. Belong to you now. <sighs> Fifty years back. Uh, Mexican conflict? When I was a young piss brain like you, I enlisted with a corp army. Was in Mexico when I realized that no matter the conflict, corps always win. Ordinary people always lose. So that the truth you decided to reveal in song? Well, deserted first. Wound up here, locked in this room. Laid in bed, staring at the ceiling fan for a good month. I wouldn't mind lying down right now, watching a fan until the end of time. It's why I brought you here. Wasting days, weeks. That's the step I want you to skip. Why are you giving me these? Imagine we're deployed together, fighting in a war, side by side. Would you take a bullet for me? I would. Yeah. Tags belong to a man who sacrificed his life for mine in Mexico. Been thinking about our predicament. Wanna be clear, I will do you no wrong. When the time comes, it'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get wiped. Tags are proof of my promise. I... I... do the same for you. Yeah. Thanks. You seriously considering Hanako's offer? Got a better idea. Not yet, but I got a request. Well? Adam Smasher. Fucker who got the better of me. Whatever happens to me, I want him zero, gone, tossed into the wind as mulch. Right. 
Understood. And I want Rogue to be there with you. It's important to me, and it's just as important for her. Not sure Rogue's the sentimental type. Hmm. Bitter bitch these days, said it yourself. And it has been a while. So I'll jog her memory myself. You'll drop the pills from Misty, and I'll steer the ship for a bit. Not at all excited about this plan. Realize that, right? Just gonna have a quick chat with Rogue about Smasher. Then I'm out, I promise. Need to know exactly what you plan to do. I'll tell Rogue the truth. See if she's willing to help. Hey, just busted out of Soul Prison. Check out my new ass. All I gotta do is mention Smasher. Serve him up on a platter. Muse over the old days. Easy. Fine. I'll do this for you. Appreciate it, thanks. Take me to the afterlife. Promise, you won't regret this. Feeling better. Should get going. Still feel a sharp something near your heart. Doubt that's ever going away. <clears throat> the Hotel Pista Sophia. That right? Mm-hmm. Good place to die. Just not today. Slides, more slides, and the biggest wave here on the West Coast, coming soon in 2079.